Very pleasant. Good evening. Welcome to our midweek edition of Lehigh Valley Sports Scene. Trust everyone's having a great day alongside Al DiCarlo. I am Mike Zambelli. Good show we have for you on tap tonight, and it starts with a battle of heavyweights in high school volleyball. Boy, you don't, it's a rarity when you get a matchup like this. Yeah, it's a rarity, and especially when you get a matchup like this in the beginning of the year. Right. You know, it's pretty interesting. It's the start of another high school volleyball season and a great matchup last night to get things going. Parkland is defending 4A state champions, playing host to Bethlehem Catholic, the defending state champions in the 3A classification. Out to Parkland High School we go. In this matchup, Becca 23-2 last season. Parkland a perfect 26-0 under veteran head coach Mike Krause. First set action, Parkland gets going on a set by Kristen Krause to Sienna Salvaggio. She's there for the kill to give the Trojans a six-point lead. Some good defense, long rallies before Morgan Sherwin finishes the point straight through the middle to increase the first set lead. Bethlehem Catholic looks to battle back. A good set to Jordan Young, and the outside hitter comes up with a kill. Close the gap to eight, it's 21-13, but Parkland, a bit too much firepower. Sam Graver comes up here with the big kill. Parkland takes the first set by 10, 25-15 is the final score. On to set number two we go, a back and forth affair before the Golden Hawks find the groove. London Laffey with a big finish to keep it tight down by two, it's 14-12. And solid defense by the Golden Hawks. Check out the huge team block right there. Nothing getting through that wall, but Parkland turns it up from there with some good defense as well. Watch Kraus there for the block. She would also add 29 assists, helping Parkland increase their lead. Another good rally near the end of the second set, but Kraus will be there for the finish. Parkland goes up two sets to zero, winning the second set by the score of 25-17. On to the third and final set. No question about this kill from Graver. He can't stop that one as the Trojans go out by 10. Graver loving that line, does it again. Monster kill here, one of 13 on the night, and Parkland on the verge of the victory. A couple points later, they go back to some great defense. Salvaggio turning away the shot. Another Parkland point. Parkland would end up with another kill by Sherwin. She finishes with nine on the night. Parkland stays perfect on the year. A quick three-set win, 25-15, 25-17, and 25-12. to I think we did a really good job of playing together as a team. Kristen did a great job of distributing the ball to our, both our outsides and the middles and to Sienna. And I also think Morgan and Sam stepped it up a lot this whole season so far with their hitting and their blocking. And I think Avery did a great job of passing and she's always good with communicating with the back row and keeping service receive good. I think it was a good start for us. I mean, it's our second game of the season and um, we're still working out some kinks, but I think we definitely um, you know, when the new players were coming on the court, we definitely pushed through, and um, I mean, I liked the outcome of today, definitely. Coming against uh, the reigning AA state champions, we knew that they were going to bring some offense at us, and they had some good arms, so we needed to make sure that we could transition and be really focused. I liked our focus today. I think there's some areas that we're a little inconsistent in the, on the floor that we'll work on and get improved, and uh, I liked our, our decisions at the net and some of the areas. The block that Bethlehem Catholic presented made our hitters reach higher and, and uh, think a little bit more sharply. So from that perspective, I like our net play. And uh, serving, we got to work a little bit, a lot of service errors. And uh, we'll get that better. 